I'm on a mission to get myself a fire cape within 45 days of membership with one major catch. I'm not allowed to play for more than an hour each day. I'm going to have to find ways to circumvent many of RuneScape's grinds in order to achieve my goal on time. Things like spending hours at Sandcrabs simply isn't viable, and every day the clock ticks closer and closer to when we have to face Jad. Is this even a possible goal, considering I'm generally pretty bad at the game to begin with? How do I use a grand exchange, and all my experience in-game comes from playing Iron Man? Will I lose my sanity or hair during this process? Find out in today's episode of One Hour Limit Locked. Hello everyone and welcome back to the series that we are about to kick off day 43 slash hour 43. Today we are preparing to embark on our final journey into the fight caves. We're going to get our gear and set up together and I don't know what we're going to do after that. Probably just going to head to the rev caves, see if I can't just get some some lucky last minute big summer blowout because i don't really know what else to do in my time i considered like spending it on chins and just trying to get some extra defense xp but there's no way really good to chin the best place i could think of was four plus dungeon spiders and like i just don't think that's gonna be good <laughs> or i could just go to scurrius and and kill him for ranged xp for the defense XP even. But yeah, I think I'll probably end up just going back to revs because you never know who, like, maybe you get like a, just a two mil emblem drop and we're happy. And like, if there's five-ish minutes left and nothing's happened, we'll probably just spend whatever extra money we have left over on extra supplies and shit like that. So yeah, that's the plan. Let's uh, dive on in. Get ourselves prepared for the fight caves. Three days left. <sighs> okay. I'm just gonna get this shit on the GE. And I'm going to uh, package my cannon up as well and get that on the GE, because we're not going back to green drugs. Not set up. Do I have to do this? Okay, I thought you could use it. Where's the cannon? Where is the cannon? Cannon, show me cannon, draw dwarf cannon, so. Right, hopefully that buys. Is there anything else we want to get rid of? We want to keep our current cell up. So, no, not really. Okay, I'm just going to pull that down ever so slightly. It was just a bit above guide price, so. Okay, uh, amethyst darts. We want 2,000. I think they're a bit cheaper when, than when I checked the other day, so that's good. Dragon darts, about the same as when I checked the other day. Zora scales. Just gonna lower the price on some of these things that aren't selling. Okay, the dragon darts haven't bought yet, but we've got the scales, and we've got our amethyst darts. Sardoin brews, super restores, regular ranging potions I might already have. I'm gonna start getting a tab together. We've got four prayer pots. Five, because we've got another one here. The dragon darts just bought. That's good. Summer pies, ranging potions. We've got just one full ranging potion left to buy. I think I'm actually just going to replace it with a bastion because we've got extra. We will have brews, but I don't know. <sighs> Maybe not actually. <laughs> Maybe we do that at the end of the day if we don't have any upgrades or anything. I'll just get a couple extra of these because we will be going back to revs. And we need like a few more prayer pots and some summer pies. And I think that's like it. I'm going to get the blowpipe loaded up, of course. I'm just getting everything together that we want to be in this loadout. Yeah, let's get this blowpipe loaded up and finally fucking equip it, eh? Let's go. We're actually holding a blowpipe. Alright. And then we can remove that just for now. Go to the bank. Put that stuff away. Got some summer pies. 
We're pretty much sorted for our uh, gear setup now. It did not take long at all, so we're going to get some decent timing at rev still to get more chance of a nice big drop, maybe, hopefully. Oh, I didn't even know I had a tab set up. That's nice. I could have used that the other day when I uh, couldn't remember if I'd brought everything. Dueling ring, we want that rather than a prayer pot. We want a looting bag. I think we're good, right? Oh, we could sell the rest of these burning amulets as well. Um, teleports, we don't need. Cool. Let's just grab a little bit of food. Check the gear, all good to go. Got the ring of dueling on. We are golden. I don't even even look to what world I'm on and how many people are online. Shit, it's kind of busy. Not, not an ideal time to be at revs at all. Oh well. What the fuck have I just done? How did I manage that? Fuck me man, I'm losing time here. Sorry. Why am I apologizing? I'm apologizing. Fucking idiot. I have a feeling this is not going to go well. Call it a hunch. But, we've already got everything. This doesn't matter. The only reason it will matter is if we can still make like two bill. Damn, actually found an open world. Guy just left. I could invest in an avarice. It probably won't be the worst idea. Because like I said, this doesn't matter anyway unless we get big. It would increase the chance of those big drops. I think I may actually just go and do that like relatively quickly. Maybe amethyst arrows too if they're not too much. I don't know how much they are. Oh, look at that. Oh. He did not look like he was interested in me. Oh well. Getting our avarice anyway. If we can. Right, it is on. Jeez, it's way too hot in my room. I need to turn the heating down. Got the amethyst, oh well. Uh, let's just get this in a loot tab. Whatever garbage it is. Need a new ring of wealth as well. Alright. The avarice does increase our accuracy and damage against revenants, as well as giving us a higher chance to roll the big drops that we actually care about on the loot table. Hopefully, we don't lose it like we did last time to someone that just logs in next to us that we were paying attention to. Might be a struggle for me to find worlds. Just gonna keep hopping. I should open up the US worlds. It is very, very busy right now. Wow, I didn't even get anything on that kill. <sighs> it's so busy. I picked a very bad time to record this. Wow. The kills are still going slow, even with the avarice. Don't want that. I died. Cool. Well, that's the end of our journey to Revenants. Didn't take long. Told you it wouldn't. Said it wasn't going to go well. Oh well, we didn't really lose anything, like 100k, but who cares. Okay, I'm gonna have to go to the G and figure out something to do, because I'm not going back to revs now that the entry fee is gone. That was literally the only reason I was there anyway. Get the avarice back on. Damn, that's less than... I bought it for 835. If I can sell it for the same, that'd be nice. I'm gonna lose money on the avarice. Oh, it's okay. Why is nothing selling right now? Alright, 1.5 mil. What can we do with 1.5 mil? Just sold all my house tellies, did I? I'm an idiot. Don't need them if those don't buy though. Don't look like they are doing. Try more parts. Okay, we got the claws. May as well see if we can get some skins now. Put them up slightly. Just got 9k a pop. Alright, follow door we go. Got two teleports here. Where's Wizen? He's doing hiding over here. Thank you. 75 seed nests. Very nice. Well, we're here. Oh no, we don't have money on us, do we? 
15 ring, 10 empty. Not bad at all. Pretty good rate, I'd say. Okay, I'll do the rings first. Okay, that's all the nests unpacked. We got a palm tree, a renar seed, couple dwarf and cadentine. We got spirit seed, which unfortunately is dead to us. Because we can't get into the farming guild. Some hogany is not that great. Landers. Hmm. We did it okay, but not fantastic there. We could still get profits, of course, out of these. I'm going to grind them up. The limit on those more parts is 50 each, by the way, which is why I did 50 of each. Okay. And we've got a little bit of money still, so let's just, while we're next to it, Curious if I buy like five of these, what the price goes up to, because we can get like one and a half K for them, but if it's like to plant one, value 1,000, buy five, value 1,150, oh that's not that bad, what if we buy them all, so it goes up to 1,600, okay, maybe I shouldn't have got that last one, maybe like buy 10 per world is good, I don't know why I didn't put all of them up. Okay, see if we can get anything out of some of these seeds, I guess. I've got rings as well. I think I'm just going to have to take them all down a little. Why am I even selling fucking pineapple seeds? Like, no one's going to buy these. Well, I don't care. They're buying <laughs> sweet corn. Why am I selling sweet corn? Like, fucking... Jeez, this is what it's come down to, y'all. <laughs> going to buy one crush nest. See what it buys at. Did I just buy one from myself? I just bought one from myself, didn't I? I'm an idiot. Okay, 8066. So, yeah, we should be fine just selling them all right. What's worrying me is the bagged plants aren't buying. I was thinking about going back there. I could just can't sell the spirit seed or do anything with it, which is unfortunate. <sighs> I need to get these nests sold. 8, but uh, 25? Let's... Come on, man. What's going on? Alright, we've approximately profited zero GP from anything we've done so far today. So, nothing out of the usual there. Get that sold. We don't need that. I'm just trying to, like, clean up, basically. See if I can squeeze any cash out of somewhere. All the random things that I oversupplied myself on on my journey. Why are things just not selling? How can I make some money when nothing is purchasing? I'm, I'm struggling to think of anything to do here, folks. And I don't think I've ever been to the nail shop with this much money before, so let's just see what we can do here. Nothing's really buying or selling, like I can't get any crystal keys, stuff struggling to sell, so I can't get rune war hammers, and the shops are probably too full even if I could. So I'm just going to buy up all the nails I can. I should open up Australian worlds as well because ping doesn't matter here. Try the PvP worlds too. Let's just see if we've actually made money so far. Yeah. Crazy. This is how we started the series at this shop. I didn't, I didn't, like, that was not intentional at all. We started the series at this shop. I just clocked that. And now we're finishing here. Absolutely wild. Hey, what's mate? Doing Gertrude's cut, are you? Good luck. Alright, we're at, like, 15.50 last I checked. 59. It's not very quick, is it? It's not really making enough money. It's very slow. It's actually better than it anticipated. I'm going to take these even lower. Just want to get rid of them. Jeez, not even buying then. What can we do? What bracelet's that? 44k ether. Only 177. No chance. What if we get... I'm really struggling. It's not going to be worth it. Can we get any Zerishan fabric? 
Okay, so if we got like four of those, it would cost us about 10k and the uh, rub bottoms. Yeah, we're not really making any profit there. Is there anything random that I could just kill a couple of times and somehow get a load of money? Should we go just send a couple kills on like the crazy archaeologist and test out a blowpipe? I probably don't want to take full gear into the world either, do I? Oh, definitely not, but oh, we should get some more black dehyde. Okay, so what does this put our risk at? Oh, we'll be risking the dragon bone necklace and the braces. We can replace both of those. We can get a combat. No, we can't. We don't have any other braces. Okay, we can just take them off. We don't have any snakeskin either because we lost it. And just take them off. Who gives a fuck? What am I missing? A jeweling ring and a glory. That's what I wanted. That is what I wanted. An amulet of glory. <sighs> I'm kind of breaking it. I'm not going to lie. A little more food maybe might help. Alright, let's just go. It's fucking ages since I've killed this guy over on what I'm doing. Pretty sure we're going with Primage. Is this one the crazy or the deranged? Is it ranged? Pretty ranged, isn't it? Excuse me, sir, why am I not hitting you? Are you oh, are you meant to mage this guy? I'm not hitting at all. I'm an idiot. I think this is the mage one. I don't know what to do. Got 1.6 mil and absolutely no idea what to do with it. Fucking crushing birds now, so I can't figure out anything better to do. Man, my wrist hurts. I wish I didn't one tick so many Karambon last night. That's not a metaphor. <laughs> yeah. We basically made nothing on that. Alright folks, are you ready for the worst thing you've ever seen in your life? Your boy has the most OP PKN setup you have ever seen. It's incredible. I'm gonna go and kill some guy with a stack of a thousand noted dragon bones. And it's gonna make me really, really happy. Oh no, this guy's PKB. me. Level 
not even mad about that. At least I did something. Like, I went into the world and something happened. I've been floundering these last couple of days, I can't even front to y'all. I should have just gone to Green Dragons for two more days. It would have worked out way, way better. As it turns out, we've done fuck all. Right, I'm gonna spend these last few minutes double checking everything with myself. The pipe. Can't wait for that for ring slow. So bad. Okay, we can get a couple more super restores in there. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda tempted to just chuck my entire stack on purple sweets. Like, what else is it doing? I'm not thinking about the future of the account right now. I'm thinking about right now. And what else is it doing? I'm not gonna get a regen bracelet. It's too expensive. There's no ring slot upgrade I can get. I'm just gonna get a fucking hundred purple sweets. My, might be the weirdest thing I've done on the series so far, but fuck it. And yeah, let's get a Bastion as well. We've got Bruise, but it's not gonna harm. What else? What else? We can get some extra Dragon Darts. Because I didn't really get many of them, I went on the low side. Those are just for Jad. Okay, maybe we can't. We can try. Open them. Okay, and some more scales, maybe. Just for the rest of our money. <sighs> Alright. There is our prep hour done. Not an awful lot achieved, just lots of stuff sorted. I'm just gonna, like, f sort out my invent. I mean, that's not looking too bad. It's not looking too bad, is it? This side's a bit empty, but obviously our darts are already in the pipe. We've got 2,000 uh, amethyst darts in there. We've got 100 purple sweets. For those who don't know, they heal between like one and five hit points, I think, each, but they also give run energy back, which will be super handy inside the caves, especially with no blood barrages or anything. Like, we have no way to heal other than the limited food that we're bringing in and the toxic blowpipe special attack. So having these purple sweets will give us a bit of extra heal and run energy restoration along the way because they don't get to bring any stands in. We don't have the room for that. Uh, but we got shit tons of prayer. Maybe too much. I could have probably got a couple extra brews in, but hoping I won't have to brew that much because I've only got so many, you know, range pots to, to re... Maybe I could get rid of, like, one prayer pot for another range pot and then another prayer pot for another brew, but it's a bit late now and the cash stack is a bit low now for that. So, yeah, this is our setup that we're looking to be going with tomorrow. We're going into the caves, in fact, just so I can get a decent screenshot. The amount of time that I wasted today doing absolutely nothing, this doesn't feel like cheating at all. Let's just get one outside the gate. I need to go back in my comments and find out. There was a guy who asked me how I disabled the floor ID, and I can't remember how all, but I know that I replied to him in the comments, so I can do that for the wavy lines. Oh. We're going in tomorrow, folks. We are locked and loaded. Can I get some hype in the comments? Can I get some luck wishing? Can I get any sort of morale assistance from y'all? Why is it so white in there? That's weird. Before this horrible challenge tomorrow that we are finally going to take care of. And leave a like on the video as well, because likes hype me up as well as comments hyping me up. Both things can exist simultaneously. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, you don't want to miss that double action packed finale, which is going to be two episodes long, and look after yourself, be lovely to one another, I will see you on the next one.